I decided that just black elastic would work well for this style. And um, being for male, I didn't want anything that was frilly. Um, <clears throat> so this got a, f a flap over and some Butterbee um, scrap corners, metal corners. Material on the inside. So um, on this left cover, I have a slip spot and a couple of tags. And um, this book is mostly um, a calendar with the months um, and then space for journaling and keeping uh, notes for his um, busy schedule. <clears throat> um, old uh, French ephemera. And um, some things about mailing and posting and traveling would be some of the add-ons. Some little information cards, things to do, keep in touch, meet me. Journal page, journal page, journal page. Some little swing outs for flap. And every one of these, um, every month, is indicated by a uh, measuring tape tab on the top. So there's January. Um, more pages for journaling. Here's an envelope. Um, with some ephemera inside. Some old gears and inventions, some paper for him to make notes on. Um, some more tags, journaling, French ephemera, little pocket, my note to him. <clears throat> little card in the back here. I've got some birds because the calendars are made with birds as well as the theme on the on them. So. I carried that through a little bit. And another tag in here. Journaling papers. Note space. Lots of note space. There's a tag here in this big pocket. Another picture I got off Pinterest. I just googled steampunk images and I got quite a bit once I got snooping around. There's February. There's the tab. Journaling page, little flip that flips up. Little page comes down. Some ephemera in here. And um, another pocket on this side. With again a couple little things for keeping track of time. Meetings. Another space for journaling. Journaling, March. Little book in here. Smaller book for more notes. Here's another tab. Flip. Spin down. Flip up. And inside of that, I have a some ephemera. An old bicycle and a postcard. And a Steampunk Hummingbird. I like that. Um, little envelope in here. Little spots to tuck things. More spaces for notes. There's April. <clears throat> Another envelope. Another flip. That flips open. There's a journaling card. Goes in. Another little pocket space. Another little journey. journaling card. And a bigger pocket in the back here with a tag. Back of that flips over. Flips open. Tag in the back. Another little card. Another tag with a little. Uh, and a messy business it was. That's from Nick the Booksmith. So some equal dyed paper. 
And of course this is indicating that it's another month. And it's May. So, um, <clears throat> there's May. There's another little envelope that's just hooked on to this page with a little, um, little metal heart. So again, just some something for him to, if he needs to clip things on. More papers. I believe this this was already May's, but I'm not sure. I may have done a couple of books here, um, digital downloads together. I'll try and uh, find the link and let you know. Oh, this was Victoria Design, I think, this stuff. And this is already May's, I believe. Um... Anyway, check them both out. And the calendar, I I don't even remember who I got that from. Somebody else I bought it from. It's out of the, some of these little units there. Some old paper. More eco dyeing. More birds. That's the month of July. Here's an envelope that's a larger size. And the center of the book. Another pocket on this side, big large one if he wants to put something in there. Maybe I'll put something in there. August. More pages, more ephemera, more spaces for journaling. September. I should circle my birth date on there. Keep them, remind him. Um, book a date with them. More journaling space. Another flip out with a, um, a steampunk bird flips up lots of space for journaling keeping notes another page another pocket a little card in the tuck spot another tag with the um, flippy on it says amusing tales of mistaken identity more space October, November, coming up here, another pocket, some contraption about the piston, another postal card, postcard, and another piece of ephemera, space for him to journal on, <clears throat> Oop, get in there, um, November, the flip up, another twist, that flips up, and um, the little book, pages, December, Another tab, another add-on, more space, more space, journaling space, journaling space, journaling space, lots of journaling space, lots of places for writing, keeping notes, and uh, <clears throat> in here is another little flip-down envelope, and um, another full poster out of Pinterest from Steampunk something, fair or something. Another big pocket here and another pocket here, actually. That one's got a flip. So, um, let's see, what have I got going here? So here's, a, uh, here's another card, nothing ventured, nothing gained. And um, Steampunk cat. And... Uh, Journaling space, little postcards, miniature postcards, and they go in this little tuck here. Nothing in there, that's why I have this card in here, upside down, so that you can see that through the window. And that makes that little card there stick out a little bit. Um, another little tiny pocket space here, a couple of little tags, and um, a little pocket with a couple more 
pieces of ephemera, steampunk, cool steampunk, and um, this page flips up, closes down, hold on to your hats, now seeing the event of the century. Um, flips down, this is a tuck, this flips up, space to write, conceal, <clears throat> notes, and at the very back page here we have a big envelope, a large envelope. So I think maybe I'll stick that little bit in there. And then I've got an old, rusty, old paper clip. Put on there. There's the back. I have nothing in there because I figured there's just enough and he'll need this to press on, so I wanted it kept smooth. So that closes again like that. You can either put that inside like that, or close it up like that, or can do it this way. So that's it. And um, I want to get this to him before um, <laughs> the year is gone and he won't need half of those calendar months. Anyway, uh, thanks for um, watching my video and if you have any comments, I'd love to hear about them. Take care.